Well, update. It is Friday the 15th. And Miss B is back to herself. She's all better. Her first meal was watermelon. Um, and after that, she just started being herself again. Pecking at the other hens. And as you can see, she's down there scritch scritching up a storm. Look at her. Oh, good girl, Mrs. B. Or Miss B, I should say. And all the other girls. Scritch scritching away. Kai had to run down and make sure her girls were doing okay. Wait a minute, I think she's going to take a grass bath. She loves to roll around in the grass after... Oh, no. Guess not. Not right now. She likes to roll around in the grass after I've weed-eated, and I just got done weed-eating that whole area over there, so... And there's Miss Purdy. Hi, Miss Purdy. That's Miss Purdy. Hi, Miss Purdy. So the girls are having fun. Most of them are hidden by the tall, lush forage. But they're all happy. They're all doing good. Miss B is back to herself again, and I am very relieved. What, you're not going to roll around on the grass? I just wanted to update you guys that Miss B is doing fine. She's back to herself. Somehow, luckily, thankfully, oh my, they're really hiding in the in the bushes. You can barely see them down there. They like that. They think they're in the jungle. Instinctively, as soon as I noticed she had fluid in her crop, I instinctively just grabbed her up, brought her over here. I sat down on the uh, picnic table bench. I flipped her head down, started massaging it, and she was and helped her vomit up all that fluid. Luckily, I caught it as soon as it happened, as soon as I noticed it was taking her down. And then even after I had her inside in the tote, I did it that night. And some putrid smelling stuff came out. And she did a couple runny poos. And the next morning I gave her one dose of apple cider vinegar water. And then later, a couple hours later, I picked out a piece of watermelon. And she went to town taking bites of it. So I put her out in the coop. Or in the run and she started uh, drinking like crazy and she, she was getting too restless to be inside so I let her stay outside and she's all back to herself again there's this opal she always acts like the leader of the whole group alerting everybody when she hears something And there's Miss Precious Shaniqua. Hi, Shaniqua. All my precious girls. Oh, here's Miss Purdy. She's the smallest of the group. She's feisty, though. She's a good girl. She's a good agar. We're all good girls. Hi, Miss Purdy. <laughs> Hi, Miss Purdy. Hi, baby. What you doing? She's very vocal. Alright, I just wanted to sh give you guys an update and show you that that uh, Miss B is doing good. What is it, girl? Hi, Miss Purdy. Uh, Hi, baby. Are you talking to me? You want me to dig for worms, don't you? Yeah, you want me to start digging in the dirt for worms, don't you, girl? 
Yeah. Oh, I know. You're over there all by yourself. What are you doing? Why are you laying down? The dog's not going to hurt you. Kai's actually turned out to be a very good girl around the hens. She thinks they're her chickens, and she's quite protective over them. Oh, hi. Hi, baby. Hi, sweetie. Oh, hi, sweetie. Oh, hi. Hi, Miss Pretty. Oh, scritch, scritch. Oh, you scritch, scritch, and then you lay down. I scritch, scritch, and then you lay down. Hi. Hi there, baby. Hi, sweetie. Hi. Oh, they think of hi. No. Uh, they think I'm going to dig for worms. They, that's their favorite thing to do with mommy. Hi. Stop. Unfortunately, dogs are disgusting. Kai, up here. Get up here. Get up here. Kai, get up here. Let's go. Let's go. Dogs are disgusting, and they will eat anything, including chicken shit. And it's... That's disgusting. That's gross. Shame on you. That's gross. Yuck. No. It's not delicious. It's gross. It's very gross. Yuck. Quit licking your chops. It's not delicious. Yuck. Yuck. Gross. Hi, babies. Hi. Okay, that's all for today, folks. Bye-bye. Just wanted to give you an update. Hi. You coming to say hi? Huh? You coming to say hi? Oh, good girl. Good girl. Yeah, she's a good girl. Okay. Bye-bye, everybody.